I couldn't believe people went up there. People worked up there. And I was like, that would be so cool. To some people were crazy and to some people were brave. You know, you need to go both ways. I embrace the adventure. You have to have somewhat of a free spirit to be up there. When you get up there, you get a heavenly moment. Yeah, it's just awesome. So, every climb is a great one. People kind of walk into a Verizon store, a T-Mobile store, and they want to know what's the, what's the greatest phone, what phone fits my needs. But the network itself is what drives it, and the people behind the networks. It's just not your normal, everyday, nine to five, monotonous routine, over and over and over. I travel a lot, so uh, it's all the time. I've been everywhere from Oregon to Washington, D.C., New York. You go everywhere, you'll come back to the office on a Friday. Monday morning, you're back out to maybe Northern California or something like that. You're up, you know, pretty early. And you can stay in the field pretty late to get your stuff done. You are in all types of weather. Extreme heat in the summer. Rain, sleet, and hell, all the greatness. You get up there and you'll feel it. I make sure I tell all my guys, you know, bundle up. There's all kinds. I think what we have in common is the tower and we all climb. If this industry stopped existing at this time, People would go crazy. The cell phones, internet, social media. It'd be like anarchy in the streets or something. The amount of work that needs to get done is, it's endless. It's, by the time we get done with this, 6G is gonna come out. Right now, I, I believe there's anywhere from 12,000, maybe 14,000 tower climbers that are supporting the 330 million people are in the United States. We're gonna need, we need 20,000 tower climbers, 25,000 tower climbers. And, uh, and we need them now. Giving the tower industry a shot, you know, it could take you a long way. I could start saving money, I could have a house. All those things are possible if you do it the right way. Being able to work hard and continue learning it's a great way to move up and you can one day make the money that you, you're looking to. It's allowed me to live the life I can live now and that's a life of adventure. I'm not in an office, in a cubicle, behind a computer screen. There's no way I could do that. But I'm enjoying my office on the field, wherever it may take me. When I first started, I was like climbing towers. I, mean, I don't know if I want to do that forever. Now I can't really see myself in a different industry. I'm literally connecting the entire world. If we don't have these towers up, there's no signal and there's no connection with each other. I'm performing my job for the world. <laughs>